Empress Valen, the Eternal Empire has taken Voss. Our forces await your command. <laughs> Lovely. Begin the hunt. And torch the planet behind you. When Voss falls, the entire galaxy will beg to serve me. Your sovereignty cannot be denied, Empress. But the Voss are a stubborn and territorial species. Brute force may impede our hunt. You're right, Scorpio. Where are my manners? Give them a five-second head start. Then, burn the planet to ash. Don't worry. We've got this. On second thought, run! Commander! Valen launched her attack early. We need you now! I read you, Theron. Hold your ground and defend the city. The Alliance is on its way. All ships, fire on the Eternal Fleet. Draw their attention away from the surface. Three minutes to landfall, Commander. Ground troops stand ready to follow you into battle. We'll touch down in the city and lead the liberation of Voss. But Valen won't make it easy for us. She's hammering the planet with the full might of the Eternal Empire. She's too eager to show off her strength. The Empress has big shoes to fill. And like her brother and father, Valen's overconfidence will be her undoing. We'll cut her down to size. Torian, what's your status? Mandalorians are ready to follow the Alliance commander into battle. I expect your warriors to carve Valen's army to pieces. If you want slaughter, they'll deliver. We're coming in fast. Brace yourselves. If you want to rally the troops, it's now or never. Warriors of the Alliance, you've served many masters, but today you serve me. Together, we'll strike a blow against the Eternal Empire. Empress Valen has declared war on Voss. Your mission is simple. Hunt down her forces and wipe out every last one of them. Such chaos demands my attention. In my absence, you completed your training and dethroned my son. But you also allowed my daughter to seize power. Now, witness the destructive might of the Eternal Throne. The throne is your bloodstained legacy. Under my rule, the throne was an instrument of peace. My daughter pursues more. Barbaric motives. If Valen remains on the throne, Voss is only a taste of the carnage to come. Like father, like daughter. Though Valen's far from matching the stunt you pulled on Zyost. My child is more powerful than you can imagine. Soon, you will see.
Good shot, Theron. I aim to please. <laughs> Next time, aim to kill. Show off. You arrived just in time. The Vaws are safe inside the Tower of Prophecy, but we can't hold out much longer. Remind me to give you a raise when this is finished. I'll hold you to it. I hate to interrupt, but we've got company. Horizon Guard, Valen's Executioner Squad. Sounds like a fun bunch. Let's get you to our command post before more show up. Greetings, Commander. The Voss feared your defeat. I knew better. I saw a vision of your arrival. I make my own future. If the Voss were smarter, they'd do the same. Everyone walks a different path. We've got a distress call coming in hot. Stand by. Xenia. Hello, Outlander. I trusted you, Senya. Why did you turn against me? I had to protect my son. Arkin is with me now. On Voss. Of course. Valen's only attacking the planet to burn her family out of hiding. And now she leaves me no choice. I need your help, Outlander. Arkin needs your help. Your son froze me in carbonite for five years, then tried to kill me many times. Why would I help him now? He can change. I brought him here to mend his broken body. Cure him of his hatred. Then Valen found us. We don't have much time. Help me hold off my daughter's army. Once Arkin's healed, he'll join your fight. I know it. Save Arkin? Didn't see that one coming. What do you think, Theron? Apprehend and interrogate. Only way to tell if he's worth saving. Extermination is safer. The Alliance can't risk war against both of Valkorion's spawn. Senya's call originated from the Shrine of Healing. The Voss and Gormak unite there to defend our home. They will aid your fight. My shuttle can get us close, but we'll have to make the final assault on foot. Lana. Gather a Mandalorian team and converge on the Shrine. Theron and I will lead the charge for Arkham and Senya. We can't let Valen reach them first. They're torturing the planet without me. The Alliance seeks a confrontation, Empress. You are wise to deny them that pleasure. Mother's all I care about. Smashing her hopes. Watching her beg for mercy. Maybe I'll throw a party and dance to her screams. She is not your only obstacle. 
Mandalorians help the Alliance break our assault on Vos Car. Their victory signals a new force on the battlefield. The Outlander. The vessel holding your father's spirit. My entire family on Vos. Oh, we are going to have so much fun. Lana here. Mandalorian strike team moving on the shrine. May the force serve you, Commander. Thought I'd see Voss and Gormak fighting together. I guess all it took was a common enemy. We'll have to thank Valen. I'll send her some flowers. Why aren't you advancing on the shrine? Many run for the shrine, all die. Hiding is the only choice. You can risk the Eternal Fleet, or you can face my lightsaber. Your choice. Eternal Fleet. No offense, but you look really small from up here. I see you took a break from saving Zakulans to dust off the petty insults. Zakul doesn't need me now. Voss does. Now if you don't mind, I'm off to protect innocent lives. Typical. We'll deal with Koth later. To the Shrine of Healing! This should be the place. Where's Senya? I'm here. I want to trust you, Senya. Convince me to help your son. The Emperor you once fought is no more. I can sense the good in him.
Sorry, am I interrupting? Valen. Quiet, Mother. I wish I'd buried you with the last of your loyal knights and Ord Mantel, but then I never would have tracked you back to Arkin. Now you can die in each other's arms. You're better than this. You're always saying that. And you're always wrong. Outlander, why don't we crack open that head of yours so Father can come out to play? My child makes a mockery of herself. Halcorian sends his regards. That's a first. Oh, sorry, I have to miss the family reunion, but I've sent you all a gift. I'll see you soon, Mother. What are you waiting for? The fleet has encountered minor complications. Gravestone dilutes our firepower, but we can compensate. Do it! We need to work together. Hold Valen off, and I'll cleanse Arkin's rage. Then we'll join your fight. I know, my son. If he regains his strength, he will annihilate you and Valen in his campaign to retake the throne. Please, Outlander. If Arkin isn't healed, he'll turn against us all. You need to trust me. Go to your son, Senya. Ensure that he's healed, and I'll hold off Valen's forces as long as I can. You won't regret this. Lana, take your Mandalorians and protect the shrine. Senya's counting on us. Hurry! Patience. Joe would be proud. I need him! No! There is not enough time. No! Take me! Do whatever you must! Just save my son! The burning star of Isaacs bathes the sea in light. Feel the peaceful warmth, touch the darkest night. Come an angry heart beneath the waves of fate.
would be proud. She's alive, barely. I held them off for as long as I could. What happened? A sacrifice. The mother's life essence to heal her son. Was Arkham healed? Yes, but he must recover his strength. Where is he? The wounded son fled. Delirious, confused. He thinks his mother perished. I'll tend to Senya. Let's go. We must stop Arkan. I've got you. Arkan! Your mother survived the ritual. She needs your help. No, you are not alone. your own battles. Kill them all. Valen's gonna disintegrate her family, along with half of Voss. ships belong to the Sith Empire. Maybe they want to join our alliance. A few seconds earlier, and they could have stopped Arkham. Arkham will return. To help me overthrow Valen, or break my neck? To destroy your alliance. You think you are unassailable, but consider the cost of your victory. Thousands killed. A planet devastated. A mother's sacrifice. There is only one way to end this chaos and bring order to the galaxy. You must seize the Eternal Throne. Claiming the throne is no simple task. You are up to the challenge. You can soon death itself. Used its power to reach new and extraordinary heights. You were the Alliance commander, champion of fear, and conqueror of my every challenge. No one is more worthy of taking the throne. Not even my children. Do you count yourself among that number? My time has passed. Only you can take the Eternal Throne. It is your destiny. Ah! Oh, they retreated! This shouldn't have happened. This is your fault! I gave the Gemini droids the freedom to choose. They simply made a choice you didn't like. Ugh. They let Mother escape. 
I'm going to dismantle every one of those droids. By fixating on Senya, you neglected a much greater threat. The Outlander. My father was there too. I felt him. And you chose to ignore him. You've been thinking like a child. Focus on the big picture. I see it now. It's all connected. And the Outlander is the key. Call coming in from the Sith fleet. It's... Empress Asina. Greetings, Commander. It is an honor to finally speak to you. What brought you here? I assume this is no coincidence. We are here for you, Commander. For the Alliance. The Sith are tired of being crushed under the Eternal Empire's boot. We wish to join your cause. And what would I gain from your allegiance? The might of the Sith Empire at your disposal, for a start. I'm proposing an alliance of two independent powers against a common foe. The Empire, I remember, doesn't keep allies for long. That Empire is dead. We have learned to evolve. While you were frozen in carbonite, many things changed. Come to Droman Kass. See for yourself. Sure, we'll head right over. That doesn't sound like a trap at all. What would I gain by betraying you? Your followers would turn against us, and we would have even more enemies out for vengeance. The Empress did put herself at risk by helping us here. Valen isn't likely to forgive that. We can meet, but you pull anything and the Alliance will be storming your world by sundown. I know better than to get on your bad side. I will look forward to your arrival. Well, I guess it couldn't hurt to visit. We've got intel, but I can learn a lot more if we're there in person. Dig up Asina's secrets. I expect results. I always deliver. I'm curious to see if things really have changed since I left. Whatever we find, this trip will be interesting. This world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. Don't tell me you're getting sentimental. I spent centuries here. You cannot imagine what I created. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. Sounds like you know each other. Lorman and I have a little history. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. Once we would have been on the same side. Now we negotiate as strangers. I didn't expect to be on Droman Kars again. I can imagine. 
Much has changed for the better since you were last here. I urge you not to be so critical, Empress. The Sith Empire has always been glorious. I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. It may not be wise to split up. Be ready if anything happens, and keep an eye on Lawman. It's Minister Lawman! Minister Lawman! Is that so hard to remember? Don't worry about us, Commander. Sith who do not approve of the alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. Taking her down is all that matters. I welcome any help I can get. This does not end with Valen. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. And then you'll betray me and claim it for yourself. Ambition was the downfall of many great Sith. I will not let it be mine. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. Engine's non-responsive. We need to bring it down. We're coming in too fast! Bail out! Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. That crash was no accident. My vessel was sabotaged. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. Lawman's behind this. I know it. Lawman lacks both the courage and competence to orchestrate a direct attempt on my life. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming. Forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. Slogging through the forest to hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. You must know who we are, huh? Do you really think you can beat us? The Geno Harridan feared no one. Not even you. The Geno Harridan? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. The hunt begins!
the beacon destroyed, comm signals still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. Even the weather is trying to kill us. We could take refuge in the Geno Haridan camp if we can find it. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. It won't be once we're done. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners, not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what he started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. I suppose a shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh. That Republic snake. Suresh is no longer in charge of the Republic. True. But intelligence believes she still holds significant power. Into the temple! I'm sure there's another way out. You've got a pretty positive attitude about all this. Being Empress of the Sith and an optimist aren't mutually exclusive. Reports from Drome and Cass claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessen is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious outlander is missing. Odessen is not the target. <laughs> 